by Thomas Ligotti from Noctuary Notebook of the Night. I cannot imagine how this voice invaded the dream, yet did not belong to it. Oh, intelligent life of a fool's future, it said. Hear this song, if only you could gaze with me from this mere rock, this tall slab, which is yet a throne to roiling seas, and to the mist, which veils a rustling paradise. And beneath those churning waters, the slow, fierce music of a dim world of monsters, deep eyes ever searching, and upon the unpatterned lands, chaotic undulations amidst vines and greenish vapor, the flickering dance of innumerable tails and tongues. And above, in the skies, smeared over with ashen clouds, leathery wings flapping. O oh, fallen beast, if only you could see all this through my lidless eyes, this sacred world of innocent hope. How willingly you would then follow the death of all your empty dreams. Innocent of hope, perhaps, I thought upon waking in the darkness. And yet, O oh wide-eyed lizard, I would hear you sing something of your pain and your panic, a paradise of prehistory. Indeed, how finely spoken, but a lyric of life all the same, of slime itself, of ooze as such. I scorn your eloquence and your world, the poetry of a living oblivion, and now seek a simpler style of annihilation. My hopes remain intact. Your split-tongued words were merely a boorish intrusion on a dream of much deeper things, the incomparably remote. And now, let me close my eyes once again to follow in dreams the backward path far beyond all noise and numbers, falling into that world where I am the brother of silence and share a single face with the void. But the reptile's voice continues to mock me night after night, and it will laugh and rave throughout all the humid nights of history until that perfect lid of darkness falls over this world once more.